Hello everyone. Today we're testing Mikrotronics R58X. It is using Rocketship 3588. It's 8 core CPU and GPU is Mali G610, so called Odin. MPU is up to 6 tops. And we would like to thank everyone who purchased Mikrotronics R58 uh, series models like R58X, Ammo, and R58 Mini. It's been almost like six months since we released Rocket Trip 3588 uh, models. We really appreciate and we would like to thank everyone who trusts us and supports us. And in return, we will also keep trying to provide uh, the best service uh, as possible as we can. And we also would like to uh, keep release a new firmware. Uh, and today the, the firmware we're testing is uh, Debian. We just made a, a very new firmware uh, based on the Wayland windowing system. So before we do the testings, we just have a very quick look of the R58X. So the front panel, three USB plus two Type-C, an earphone microphone. And for a fully made aluminum casing and then it's a 2 HDMI, 1 DP uh, HDMI is 1 in, 1 out, a DP is out dual Wi-Fi G9 network and dual Wi-Fi antenna RS232 and RS485 so I think people who purchased they are very familiar with the R58X now And for the PCB MAM board, uh, if we check the inside, the one we, uh, we get here, it's, uh, we install the SSD. So it's M.2 PCIe 3.0. So we connect the Samsung 500 uh, SSD, it's 988, uh, it's 500 GB. Okay, let's go to the Debian systems. Before we do the testings, we have a very quick look of the um, firmware. It's about Debian Blueberry, it's over code name. It's like a Top Gun, you, you, everyone have a code name, I think. Uh, Windows systems Wayland. And then we go to, okay. GL Mark 2. So let's see the new firmware scores when we are releasing this new firmware. Again, we are very grateful for all the customers who purchased Mikrotronics R58X, R58 Mini PC during the last uh, five or six months uh, since we released the new uh, Rocket Chip 3588. It is a very new chip site, so, so Rocket Chip then also uh, keep releasing a new SDK patch and give us to, uh, give us to, to do all this upgrade. Uh, we will keep supporting customers with all these new firmware and features. The chips that we use is Rocket Chip 3588. Um, so we, we have all these uh, uh, unique features like HDMI input, um, an M.2 PCIe, and all these different uh, USB port. And these days we, we keep uh, collecting different customers' opinions and, and ideas. So very soon we will have an upgrade version of R58X, um, adding different features. Uh, we will 
I think at the beginning of November, uh, we will show the customers uh, the new new R fifty eight X. And of course, the R fifty eight X, it's um, the R fifty eight uh, RK thirty five eight eight is very interesting chipset. It can do many different uh, tasks. Uh, can be used on different applications. So um, we would like to try the very best to cooperate with different customers and uh, provide the support and service to to fulfill uh, different purpose and goals on the different scenarios and applications. So, so far for our operating system, we have uh, Android 12, Ubuntu 20.04, we are working on 22.04, and then Debian 11. And Debian, we have X11 windowing system and Wayland windowing system. And of course, the last one is uh, Bootroot. We also did a couple of videos on the YouTube channel with Bitroot um, operational systems. And of course we we very thankful for all the customers when they uh, meet different issues or, or problems in both software or hardware, um, I think mostly software, and how hardware of course from time to time, because uh, it's very new, new models. But we try to um, fix all of that and try to release new firmwares too, and also new uh, solutions. So at the meantime, we have very new items and. You will be the first one to have the new products, new chipset, and there could be new issues happening, and we will fix that. So we are very, very thankful and grateful. So now the GL Mark II is uh, still doing the testing. I think could be another two or three minutes to finish. Uh, let's see what would be the score. Again, the sample we're testing today is uh, R58X. And it's a 16G. RAM and 64G ROM. Okay, here's the score is 3696 after all the GL Mark II testings on um, Microtronics R58X, 16G DDR, 64G. Uh, EMMC. Okay, so I thank you everyone. Thank you very much and wish you all have a very great, great day. Thank you.